We are so stupid that we can't solve our own problem. We begin begging and praying for solutions to be offered to us because we are so reliant on an established system in order to live life. We know no other way. During the initial chaos of the dollar collapse, they continue faking terror events all over the place. Shootings, bombings, virus scares, man-made weather disasters. Enter the United Nations with a plan to save us. They tell us that in order to get back on track and restore order, all nations and people of the world must unite under a one world authority, a one world rule for everyone to follow. We're so eager to regain safety and comfort that we all jump at the opportunity. But with the one world rule comes the one world government, obviously, the one world currency, one world clothing and food distributors, even a one world religion. The unity of religion agreement is a groundbreaking promise of religions to unite condition unconditionally and without discrimination to achieve true peace. I would like to call upon the following religious leaders to come up to the stage and join us for the signing of the ceremony of the unity of religions agreement. We still have some time before all this happens, but it's surely on the way. One World Trade Center. A major milestone that, as that building opens its doors this morning, the first tenants are moving into the tallest and most expensive building in the Western Hemisphere. One of the next phases for humanity is getting as much of the population crammed into megacities as possible. They will most likely use some of the megacities to contain undesirables, just like the movies Escape from New York and Escape from LA. Later after that, once the undesirables are totally wiped out, the One World Order will truly begin. They will have an unquestioning and obedient society of individuals that were born into a world that never knew freedom at all, so they have nothing to compare the current conditions to. It will be exactly like The Giver, where you have to take a shot every day on the way out the door to suppress your feelings. Same thing in the movie Equilibrium. Shots in the neck to suppress your emotions. One world order, the illusion of choice is removed from the equation, and the people living in that time won't even know that. We will be issued our clothing like on the movie The Island. We will be eating mystery food, maybe bug bars like on Snowpiercer, or maybe undesirables from the prison regions will keep us fed, kind of like the film Soylent Green, where they eat people and don't even know.